the seat in front of you. You found the right clue as you touch the yellow tag to carry on. For your own safety, please stay focused for the next few minutes even if you're already familiar with the safety instructions. Today is my first morning here in Finland. I am currently staying at my mother's place and she lives in Helsinki, which is the capital. Today's plan is to actually go and do a day trip to another city. And I thought it would be a fun idea to film a separate video from that. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start filming that video and I'll see you guys again a bit later today. So see you soon. Me and my friend Henry came to a rooftop terrace. We came to this absolutely beautiful rooftop restaurant and bar located in the city of Espo, which is in the capital region of Finland. The food here is quite pricey, so this time we only decided to go for some drinks. The views from this place were so beautiful, especially during a summer evening. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> My friend paid for this Heineken here in Finland 10 euros. <laughs> so expensive alcohol. Well, my cola was also 550, so quite a pricey cola, but you pay for the view. Today is another day here in Finland. Um, yesterday I didn't actually really film a lot because it was my brother's birthday and also my cousins and uncle came to visit and I hadn't seen them in many many years. So I felt a bit awkward to whip out my camera and yeah. But basically we had a bit of a barbecue party and made some hamburgers and it was very lovely. And yeah, then in the evening we just relaxed and we went out with my mother's foster dog and watched a movie. <laughs> and it was a very lovely day spent together with family. And yeah, I don't get those kind of days very often being someone who lives abroad. So I decided to just enjoy it. Today is a bit more of an eventful day again. I'm starting my day with some editing and soon I'm gonna head into Helsinki city center where I am meeting up with a friend and we are going to this cute like Parisian style cafe and then after that I'm gonna meet up with some more friends and we're gonna have another like barbecue evening. Here in Finland barbecue food and barbecuing is a big thing in the summertime and I have honestly quite missed the Finnish barbecues so I don't mind at all to now be barbecuing for a second day in a row. So yeah, I'm gonna finish up the editing that I need to get done today and then let's start heading towards the city center.
weather is just so nice. I'm loving it. They were saying it's gonna be really cold in Finland when I'm visiting, but it's not. It's quite warm, the sun is shining. It's actually too warm for this jacket. I'm just too lazy to take it off. Yeah, loving life. to my friend's house and yeah we're gonna be barbecuing i accidentally didn't press the bus stop button early enough so i went past the bus stop where i was supposed to get off getting a few extra steps in for the day i don't mind necessarily and the weather is really nice there will be two of my friends there and some doggeronos also and some good barbecue foods Grillimeisteri hommissa. Hänelle maistuisi myös. <laughs> then it was time to jump on a bus and head to the city of Turku which is located about two hours away from Helsinki in the southwestern part of the country I have arrived to the city of Turku in Finland and I'm currently here with my friend Adelina! <laughs> Oh my god! Noni! Noni! Hello! 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 I have now said goodbye to Adelina and I came to the park or we're sitting here by the Aurao. This is a place I used to sit by always when living here. And I'm now with Miranda and Miranda has just gotten a puppy named Mauno and Mauno is like what? 10 weeks old? Uh, 11. 11 weeks old. <laughs> And he has a lot of energy. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna have a bit of a picnic here. Feels very nostalgic. That was worth. Must destroy. Yeah. I just got a ride and yeah, came to my grandparents' place. Uh, we're first gonna go to the shop with my grandma. I'm gonna see a bit how much I film though, because yeah, I get to spend so little time with my grandparents and I really wanna be present in the moment. So yeah, I'll be spending the night here. Yeah, oh, there comes my grandma. So see you in a bit. See you tomorrow.
Good morning, it is now the next day and today we have a very warm day here in Turku. Currently I am at the bus stop with my grandma and we are on our way to an art exhibition and I think my little cousin or second cousin is also going to join us. And I just found out that also my aunt is joining. We just went to the art museum and now we're on our way to get some lunch, I believe. It's nice to spend some quality time together with some family members. <laughs> time with my aunt and my second cousin and my grandma and we went first to the art museum and then we had some lunch together sitting outside and now my Seuralainen, like my account, I don't know. Yes, your recurring guest star is yeah. back. <laughs> yeah. And now I'm with Sofia and we are here trying to decide what ice cream to buy. I think I'm gonna go for this. This is my absolute favorite ice cream in the whole world. It's a salty licorice ice cream and this one is like very, it has a very intense flavor. I love it. Let's try. Mm. It's so good. Love it. Next we are going to these, they're called the uh, Joki Laivat <laughs> and they are a very popular and iconic spot here where to spend time in the summertime and in the weekends and evenings this is where people party on these boats and yeah I have a lot of fun memories from there so I wanted to go and visit them now as well. So we came to one of these bar boats here. You can also get food here, but yeah, these are popular places for people to come and party in the summertime, but yeah, now it's the daytime, so it's much calmer. Yeah. And I ordered an alcohol-free rosé cider. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. How are you doing, Sophia? I'm doing good. I was at work today, so I'm a bit tired, but I'm doing mm. good. I get to see Yannick right again. <laughs> Do you have any summer plans? Well, I'm going to a festival here in Turku, Ooh. Ruisrock. I wish I could go to Ruisrock as well. Look at that butt. <laughs>
it has been so so nice to visit Turku so yeah this is a city where I studied and lived for five years before moving to the Netherlands even if I'm from Helsinki originally coming here almost feels more like coming home and I have so so many great memories from this city and especially now visiting in the summertime and it's been very lovely and nostalgic to visit and yeah it was nice to meet some friends and to spend time with some family members and yeah it has been a very very lovely time I'm super happy currently it is like 6 30 p.m. and I am waiting to take a bus back to Helsinki I wish I could have spent more than just one night and like two days here fortunately I don't have time for that this time but hopefully if I could maybe visit Finland next summer or something I could stay in Finland for a bit of a longer time and then I could also spend a longer time here in Turku if you ever visit Finland especially in the summertime I really recommend coming here to Turku and also here around the Turku region there's a lot of lovely lovely places where to visit uh, hopefully someday in the future I will get to share those places with you guys this was it for this time now let's head back to Helsinki morning last night i didn't sleep very well because i've been having a bit of like stomach cramps and also a headache ever since yeah i started feeling really bad yesterday on the bus and i still feel quite mm, a little bit better at the moment luckily i've been able to just take it easy now in the morning today i have honestly just been resting and petting the dog very much and later today we are gonna go and swim in a lake and there's also a sauna there and then after that i am meeting up with some friends and we are going to a very beautiful location <laughs> just swimming by the lake and in the sauna and it was so nice and now um, I'm getting a ride from my mom and I'm meeting up with some friends and we are going to this really beautiful like park with flowers and yeah I'm excited I came now to the park with my friend Rosa, Krista, Laura and Momo. <laughs> my friend brought her cat with her and she's very popular here. I feel like she's more popular than the flowers and people are even asking to take pictures with the cat and everything. It's quite cute. <laughs> so, what do you think about Mikan Alpiros? Rododen. 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 Mun dyslexia ei nyt. Rododendron. 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 A very difficult word. Rodo. But that's these flowers, what they're called. In Finnish they're called Alpiruusu, which basically means the rose of the Alps. Yes. <laughs> yes.
siinä on joku hyvä. Oh. Thank you, thank you, and thank you for the camera filmer man. Very shaky. So beautiful here. There's a lot of people here, so yeah, we're definitely not alone here, but I can't blame them. So today's plan is that we're gonna head soon to our summer cottage and I'll be spending my last few days of my trip here to Finland there at the cottage. So I'm gonna start a new video for that and in this video because I have already filmed quite a lot for this video I know it's been a bit all over the place because to be fair I have been all over the place but I hope you have enjoyed it remember to subscribe to my channel so that you'll also see the upcoming videos from Finland and the Netherlands and all other places I have a lot of fun trips planned and coming so yeah stick around if you're interested thank you so much for watching and i'll see you again on my next adventure bye bye